Uh, hey, what's up, YouTube? This is We All Juggle Knives with some real talk. Real talk about fitness. The gloves are off, man. The gloves are off. This is going to be, as I said, real talk, okay? People tend to not take responsibility. I, I gotta, you know, you gotta see that I'm not a, I'm not a fucking fat ass like I used to be. I used to be 85 pounds of, blub of blubber uh, heavier, right? Never listen to anybody about weight loss, fat loss, or nutrition if they don't have a picture or, or if they're scared to death to even uh, show what they look like. All right, so as you may know, I used to have a big old gut that was out to here, and then I lost 85 pounds of body fat, and I also added a lot of muscle, so I have not regained any belly fat or any, any fat at all. I'm doing well. All right, and I really hope that you're all happy and healthy. I hope that you're sticking to your programs. Definitely keep the faith, remain positive, check out the fitness uh, playlist for all sorts of tips and just, uh, you know, motivation, inspiration, want to help people lose fat as I did. Yeah, you got to take responsibility. You know what I see? People act like they just became obese accidentally. It's like a person who hits himself in the head with a hammer and then complains he has a headache, right? It's like a person who, uh, who jumps off a cliff. You have a motherfucker jump off a cliff and then they complain the ground is coming up really fast. All I was doing was... Uh, hanging out here in midair, minding my business, and the ground for no reason is just coming up so fast. Bro, that's what happens when you jump off a cliff. The ground, the ground was always there. It's your actions that made it a danger to you. The food was always there. It's the way you interacted with it that made it, instead of being nutrition, you made it poison by consuming too much of it, right? So these motherfuckers, you know, you can't jump off a cliff and then, and then pretend that the problem is the ground. The problem is that you jumped in the first place. Don't play innocent. Wherever you are in life, you are exactly where you navigated yourself to. Yeah, but nowadays you'll have people that they act like their obesity, they act like they were out for a walk and a thunderstorm suddenly rolled in and they got wet. Motherfucker, it's more like you jumped in a pool and then got wet. Right, when you're a beast, don't give, don't give me this bullshit like you accidentally went to McDonald's a thousand times. Nobody accidentally does something a thousand times. Your present situation is just an output of your past decisions. It was a conspiracy. You conspired against yourself, you know? You conspired either to destroy yourself, or maybe you made good choices and you conspired to succeed. But as I said, I'm feeling pretty good, feeling strong. I definitely hope you're all doing well as well. There's no exercise that's gonna show off your muscles if those muscles are covered by a layer of body fat. Make sure your nutrition is on point. Now try to remember, you wanna surround yourself with positive influences and supportive people who share your values of health. There comes a time in your life when you gotta pay the bills for who you are. The decisions you've made in your life. It's never too late to start taking personal accountability for your actions. All right, this has been We All Juggle Knives. I'm out.